Hi everyone. In this lecture, we will see a problem based on time invariant or time variant systems. So the question will come like test the following system for time invariancy, right? So the system equation is given as y of n is equal to 2n into x of n, right? So general expression we know like y of n is what basically transform of x of n, right? So basically transform of x of n is what equal to y of n and y of n is equal to what here? 2n into x of n. So just remember this point. Fine. Now what you have to calculate basically, you have to calculate the output due to the input delayed by m units. It means you have to calculate y of n comma m. So this is nothing but a transform of x of n minus m. Okay, which is basically what in the last lecture we covered, right? It is basically nothing but y of n itself when x of n is equal to what? x of n minus m. Now wherever x of n is present just replace with x of n minus m in this equation. So it will become what? 2n x of n minus m. Clear? So this is what y of n minus sorry n comma m n comma m. So this we have calculated which is nothing but the output due to input delayed by m units. This part is done. Now you have to calculate what the output delayed by m units. So how to calculate this? So basically output delayed by m unit means what? y of n minus m you have to calculate. It means what simply y of n when n is equal to n minus m. So wherever n is present just replace with n minus m. So if you see the equation n is present here and 1 is x of n. So it will become what? 2 it will become what? 2 into n minus m into x of n minus m right so we have calculated y of n minus m and we have calculated y of n comma m now tell me here do you think this two are equal not equal right these two are not at all equal so from here the conclusion is y of n minus m is not equal to y of n comma m so if it is not equal right so the output delayed by m unit is not equal to the output due to input delayed by m units here fine so you can see like this system is what this system is time variant system time variant okay because it does not satisfy this condition so it is a time variant system so that's all this is what you have to do exactly nothing else fine so thanks for watching this video if you have any questions regarding this numerical you can ask in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel